Hello, hello, queens. It's Kanisha with Currency Queen Budgets. In this video, I will be cash stuffing my bills. If that's something you're interested in, stay tuned. All right, guys, so we are going to jump right into paying these bills. Um, how has everyone been doing? I am doing great on my end. All right, so let's jump right into it. We are at a different angle. Um, so my setup is a little bit different because I am moving some things around. So please forgive me if this video is a little bit too dark, but we are going to jump right into this cash stuff and we are not going to be very long on this video. We're just going to stuff some bills. All right, guys, so let's jump right into this video. If you are new, I hope you consider hitting that like and subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so that you are notified every time I upload content. And leave me a comment and let me know that you are new. So let's jump right into it. Let's see what we have for our bills. So we have 100, 200, 300. 54, 55, 56, 620, 40, 50, 60, and 65. So we have $665. I'm just going to move the money over here for now. Um, I've been doing a little moving around, so that is why my setup is a little different. I... Um, didn't bother getting my tray out for my money so i'm just going to lay it here for now and hopefully this video works out just fine so what we're going to start with is credit cards isn't getting anything and i don't know why that was sitting there um my card note is going to get $150, so I'm going to take $150, and this feels so funny doing it like this, but I kind of like this setup a little bit better for now. So we have $100, $200, $250, $300, in card note. Um, but yeah, I'm just doing a little moving around in my home. Um... I recently moved all of my things to um, a storage unit so it could hold my inventory, but I'm just trying to see and get the feel of it to see if I like it. It is an indoor storage unit, you know, and I planned on moving all of my things there, you know, to have it as like a little office and also I can do my orders there, but I kind of like it and I kind of don't like it. So it, there's there are pros and there are cons to that inside storage unit. And I think I wanna do a video on that. I might um, just do a video talking about that, but we'll see. So for my insurance, I am going to stuff $80, which will be um, 50, a 20, which is 70. Then I'm gonna do a 10. So that is $80. And this is for my car insurance. For both my vehicles, my home insurance and life insurance. I pay all of that in one place. For my cell phone, I am going to do $85. So I have 50, 70, 80, and 85. For my utilities, I'm going to do 100. And for rent, I am going to do $250. So that's 100, 
$252.50. So that's $250 for my rent. And subscriptions isn't getting anything and student loan isn't getting anything on this um, video today. So you guys know I've been wanting to break my videos down and do a weekly video of cash stuffing. So this is what this is. I am paid by weekly, but I decided to break everything up into weekly videos and cash stuff every week. That way I am... Um, I guess getting more videos out and being held accountable so i do leave those funds in the bank and i think i did it to make sure i am disciplined enough not to touch it not to swipe that card and i was successful on doing that so um if you have not already um don't forget to go back and hit that like and subscribe button leave me a comment and hit that notification bell so you are notified every time i upload content but you guys know until next video i want you to hustle hard budget hard and pray harder be blessed queenies bye